Hey guys, welcome to Little Black Book 91. Real quick one. Listen, I was just on Instagram. I don't know if you have seen it yet. There was pictures that were dropped by Netflix, Love is Blind. It's gone off now uh, because they were quick to, to catch it. But uh, because they put up a post of, of Ashley and Tyler and the rest of the castmates for the reunion pictures. Here's one of them. Now you're probably going to have to zoom in. I know you can't see me, but don't worry about me being seen. Look, if you look at the left hand, do we see a rig? Do we see a ring? We don't see a ring, right? Um, actually, on actually, um, on Tyler's hand, do we see a ring? We don't see a ring for me. So the question is, are these guys still together by reunion? I'm really hoping that Ashley isn't with him solely because I believe there's a lot of work that needs to be done for Tyler. And I don't think it's going to be beneficial for them to be together right now if it is to ever work. Um, you know, but, you know, I, I, I looked at the situation. And I was like, why did they take it down so fast? Like literally, um, shout out to, to one of my peoples who helped me out. They know who they are. And they sent me the, the post saying about, oh, look, there's no rings on their hands. I looked at the post. and I was like, yeah, there's no ring on their hands. Oh, my gosh. And then within about two minutes of looking at the, the, the post, the post is down. Just down. And I was like, damn, I didn't get the photos. And um, my, um, the person in question sent me the, the pictures again once more. So as you can see, Ashley's hand, we don't see no rock on that hand. We don't see no rock on that hand. And on Tyler's hand, we don't see no rock on that hand. We don't see no rock on that hand. So listen, maybe they're not together. Maybe, who knows, but the reason, but it, it seemed more guilty that they took the post down for me personally, that there was probably something else going on. So, you know, hey, look, I don't want to say too, turn any, anything too more. I think there's enough that I need to say. I just want to put that out there for you guys. Mm. I really do want Ashley to, to lead the situation though. Can I, can I be honest with you? I'm not going to leave it alone, but I want her to take some time out. I prayed earlier on, on a live earlier on. But I really want Ashley to take some time out and really just think about where she wants to be. Now, obviously, I follow Ashley on Instagram and she has always posted um, posts on her page as well. But I noticed that she put up a post that didn't have the ring on her hand. Now, I hope she doesn't block me for this. You know what I'm saying? See, that's why I haven't shown anything. Um, you know, because I, I, I follow her and I, I like following her. She's a good lass. She's really beautiful. She seems intelligent. She seems smart. You know what I'm saying, too? Um, but I was looking at the hand. Okay, and I didn't see no ring on that hand. I didn't see no ring on that hand. I hope I don't get in trouble for that either. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if I do. I want to show it. Let, let me just. Okay, you can go into a page and see it anyway. But let me just quickly just show you the the ring on the hand. I didn't see no ring on that hand. Do you see the ring? Cause I don't see no ring. Okay, let me stop singing. It's annoying. Um, <laughs> I realize it's bad annoying. I'm like, I'm annoying. Um. I, I don't see no ring on the hand. I said, zoom in, zoom in. I said, where is that ring on your hand, baby? Very nice nails, by the way. Very, very pretty woman. Um, But I said, I don't see no ring on that hand, baby. I said, I don't see no ring on that hand. Yes, but you laugh, baby, because I think you're free from the clutches of the enemy. I think she's free from the clutches of the enemy. You know what I'm saying to you? I don't see no ring on the hand. And that was put up um, a day ago. So I was like, hmm, maybe there is no, maybe they're not actually married. And then she posted up another thing about three days ago. And I still don't see no, I don't see no ring on that hand. I don't see no ring on that hand. We don't see no ring, baby. We don't see no ring. We don't see no. Okay, stop, stop it. Let me stop. Let me stop. Let me stop. Cause you came here to watch this, <laughs> baby. You know what I'm saying? True. I really do like Ashley. She's really a good lass. Honestly, she's a stunning lass and a, and a good babe. Now, this was obviously a post that she took up. This was a couple of days ago. This was three days ago. But this seems to be when they were in the household. She's carrying the cup. You know, she got to do what she got to do for the for the promo. You know what I'm saying? True. And I really dig it. I really understand it. Um, but hey ho, look. I don't see a ring on that hand, and I'm hoping that means that you know what that she. You know what, maybe she went through the marriage and then maybe she started to see things and didn't actually want to be it. Maybe the contract, she felt like she had to go through with it. You know, sometimes you're under duress, it feels like you ain't got a choice. Maybe that was it, I don't know. But either way, all I do feel like is like, listen, hey, 
I want to see her win. You know what I'm saying to you? I don't want to see her suffer underneath the hand and the guise of a scam artist and somebody who's got an addiction to scamming people because that is what I describe Tyler as being based on the evidence we've been starting to see, the judgments, the fact that he owes so many people money, the fact that he, the way they've done with the baby mother, the way he denied the kids. It's given addiction, it's given scam artists, and I don't want to see that for somebody. You know what I'm saying? She, especially our black sisters, I don't want to see that. Not because I want to pander, but because I also have sisters. And if it was a man in the same same way, the same way I said about Hannah and Nick, I don't want to see Nick with Hannah when she can't respect and appreciate who the man you are in her life. I don't like that kind of stuff. We should be looking at healthy relationships in life. We should have relationships that benefit us, relationships that actually are going to work for us. You should not be in a place where you are constantly worried and wondering whether this person in front of you is actually who they say they actually are and I'm sure when she looks at the evidence when she asks for the paperwork that should have been a glaring sign that something ain't quite right and I hope that maybe that played a factor in a role because we saw by the weddings they got married so um you know uh, hopefully this is like a, a delayed reaction and she's kind of come to it's come to the understanding of what it actually is and I hope the people that love her the most got around her rallied around her and kind of give her some you know hopefully some some of, some of these truths because we're not trying to break nobody we don't want to see nobody be broken I like that's why I'm trying to be very careful with my reviews these days as well like I, I I understand that it's very difficult to do certain things now I understand how hard it can be to let go of something that you've always dreamed of and wanted we know that because she told us that from the pods that she wanted it to be the man that would be uh, different to the, what she had experienced in her household. Her mom had been married twice, um, right? And it didn't work out. So I can understand that feeling of wanting to get it right and then not wanting to quit too early because you don't want to be a, a, a quitter. You don't want to be somebody who just quits and you don't. You wanted to break the generational curse. But sometimes to break the generational curse, we have to make different choices. And sometimes that means we have to go through certain rings of fire that begin to purify us like gold in the in in the fire and begin to remove the impurities from that right that's why the bible says he purifies us like gold in that fire and so we are tested our works are tested through that fire and so i really hope i really hope that by saying well, what we just saw the evidence potentially that ashley and tyler they are not together yeah ashley please if you watch this please don't hate me you know what i'm saying to you? i really like you you know what i'm saying to you i wasn't trying to you know but i just saw that on a page and i said to myself i'm seeing the two together it's not making sense you know what I'm saying to you, right? And maybe, you know, this is about keeping up appearances because they've got to do it because the 30th of October. Maybe that's what it is. You know what I'm saying to you? And I, I, I understand that, you know? Um, so I, I totally get that, you know? But yeah, listen, when I saw that no ring on the hand, there was no ring on the hand. When I saw there's no ring on the hand, I got a little bit excited. I got a little bit excited. <laughs> I can't lie, I got a little bit excited. I said, please, I beg. I hope that she, you know what I mean? Because you just hope, you hope for the person. And really and truly, can I be really honest with you? We've got to the eight minute mark. Okay, all right? Because listen, I got to go. I'm late for uh, something and I, you know, I'll, if I stay here, I'm going to be for an hour. I got to go. Appreciate you guys. Listen, sing it with me. There is no ring on the hand. That note was off, but don't worry about that. Listen, she ain't got no ring on the hand. Uh, I appreciate y'all. Stay locked, stay little. We'll see you again soon.